What's good, guys? If you're looking for cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure I head over my sponsor. Use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout for the most cheapest, most fastest, most quickest, reliable what's good youtube it's your boy bugs back on another nba 2k 22 my team video and guys today in this video we are going over the best night filters in nba 2k 22 my team so if you guys are new to the channel make sure to sub it up comment down below for some more giveaways or more giveaways and obviously um more auction videos like this i pretty much do auction every day um that's why the only thing about 2k that i actually like i enjoy the market i enjoy making mt Obviously, I enjoy playing the game, but I am banned on my main account, so it's kind of tough. But yo, um, other than that, if you guys do need any sort of MT, hit me up. I am buying and selling MT on all consoles. So if you do need MT, make sure to hit me up. Um, yeah, so yeah, MT, all that good stuff. You know how it goes. You know how it be. So yeah, um, let's go over the market a little bit. Let's go over it. Let's see what's going on. So market, um, we're going to go over that. Top nine filters. Also, like I said, for the giveaway, guys, comment, sub, like the video. Follow me on Instagram and on Twitter. We got to do a giveaway. I keep saying I'm going to do it, but like, I just, I'm just stupid. I'm trying to cook up a really good giveaway. I'm in the works uh, of it with my sponsor to give a lot, a lot of MT away. So yeah, um, let's go over these top snipe filters, man. There's a lot of good snipe filters. In my opinion, you guys know my first snipe filter that I'm going to go over. Um, obviously, this is not the best snipe filter right here. Diamond. It's actually pretty solid though. I actually like it because Aaron Gordon's out of the picture now. Um, so now we have all these guys. Now, who do you buy? You go, you do not buy 22 NBA season. You just got to really know the market. Um, that Evo Koo is pretty interesting. That Bargnani is pretty interesting in investment-wise. I think Bargnani is actually a really good center. And especially with his three-point ability, um, he's actually a pretty good buy. So now, what's a buy? Honestly, the only 22 NBA series player I would buy is probably LeBron. Just because it is LeBron. He's hype beast. Everyone loves LeBron. So yeah, definitely keep your eyes on that LeBron 22 series. That's about it. But yo, dive filter could go absolutely insane. So put your maximum buy to five-something. Scroll through a little bit. See what's going on. You can make a lot of MT off this filter. <clears throat> like I said, though, when sniping, bro, you got to be patient. You got to have that patience. If you're not patient, sniping is not the thing for you. Um, yeah, diamond filter, solid. Honestly, very solid filter. We're going to go over the next filter, though. Amethyst filter, in my opinion, the best filter in the game. Has the most profit margin. Cards sell quick. Um, there's just a ton of snipes. People don't really care about amethyst, so like a ton of snipes get popped up. So if the card is worth like 2K, people put it off for like 1400 and you can actually make that 600 MT that quick. Um, as of right now, though, today's Sunday. There is no crazy market crash on Friday. It was more like Tuesday. So the market actually rose a ton. So if you do have cards, if you have solid cards for sale, um, if you have a good team, Rouse a really good time to sell. I'm not going to lie. Um, so yeah, now's a really good time to sell. That Boris DL is an absolute steal. I have no MT, though. So yeah, do this. Try to have this filter. Do the dime filter. We have another filter, obviously. The best filter in the game, profit margin-wise, if you do get a snipe. Galaxy Opal minimum buyout. There's not a lot of Galaxy Opals on the filter yet. Uh, I think there's Bosch, Clay Thompson, LeBron. We got Curry on here. We got Durant. There's probably like seven, eight Opals. So, and this Luka, <clears throat> I think the Luka, bro, is not going to hold its value. Like, this card's not good at all. This card's terrible. The Luka card's terrible. Um, his offense is obviously really good, but his defense is absolutely terrible. So, yeah, his terrible defense really does ruin the card, in my opinion. Like, I'd rather pick up this Clay Day any day, look at his stats, and then look at his dang perimeter D steal and stuff. So, Clay's obviously the better Bob. Yeah, if you do snipe out Galaxy Opal minimum buyout and it does work out, this is the best filter. So, there's three filters. Let's go over my last filter, I believe. Or we have another filter out of this, like five snipe filters. Diamond contract, guys, super slept on as of right now. They're still super cheap. And in my opinion, I believe you should invest in diamond contracts. Like, literally, if you have like 100 cases around, just go grab one for like 10 to 12k and just hold it because right when like the end of the year pops up everyone wants diamond contracts everyone just literally wants contracts so when like op op players come out like 99 overalls these diamond contracts value skyrocket if you remember last year diamond contracts were at like 30,000 mt like all year so yeah definitely do that and the last filter i'm going to give you guys is this one right here minimum buyout uh yeah minimum buyout 600 or maximum buyout 550 minimum buyout 500 this is the best filter in the game some people mess up put their cards or galaxy opals for 550 i've missed a ton of galaxy opals on this before um i missed some crazy snipes in here it's just very high very very competitive so like it's it's hard it's really hard but yeah other than that that's all we got for the vid hope you guys enjoy top snipe filters let me know if you guys like it let me know if i miss any snipe filters and yeah that's it have a good one boys peace